My name is Amanda Waller. I am the director of Argus, a division of Homeland Security you've never even heard of. But we've heard of you. And I'm here to make you an offer. You're tenacious as junkyard dogs. Desperate. Hungry. You know how to survive. Now that might make you the kings and queens of Arkham, but outside these walls, the world's forgotten about you. And you're going to spend the rest of your lives picking maggots out of prison meatloaf. I could change that. I could be your way out. A chance to do some good. And if- Hey, Holly Quinn, Arkham Gazette. Just a quick question. What's with the frickin' shark? I, uh, would be happy to introduce myself. That won't be necessary, King Shark. This is a microbomb injector from our friends at LexCorp. Stick it in your target's neck, and it's good night. You want this to be where you take your last breath? No? Then help me. I only need one of you. As for the other three, you are dead already. So, show me what you got. So... All right, sorry. So, makes sense Waller would want the world's deadliest assassin in her pocket. <laughs> I don't know what she wants the rest of you for. Knowing Amanda Waller, it is nothing good. In my experience. What the heck is your experience? And what's the fish doing in Arkham? You got mental health issues, Shark. Generalized anxiety. But I was brought here from my home. The ocean? Bell Rev Penitentiary. Can you all focus for one damn minute. This is clearly a trap. Any of us touch that thing, none of us is getting out of here. Ah, the prisoner's dilemma. What's the bloody dilemma? This prisoner wants out. Come on, Captain. You just got here. I've been inside five freaking years. Feels like I've been stuck in this conversation for five years. Can we please? Oh, so sorry, Deadshot. Are we interrupting your being strapped to a gurney? Isn't Deadshot supposed to be white? Aren't you supposed to be shutting your damn mouth? Kangaroo looking ass. Because you are Australian. Okay, so are we gonna do the murder each other thing or what? Cause I'll be straight with you. I'd kill anyone to get out of here. I'd kill you. I'd kill myself. Nobody's killing anybody. If no one goes for the bomb, Waller comes back in here. See, she's not dealing with four screw-up psychos. We all get out. So then we do nothing. Excellent. I have grown quite skilled at... <laughs> Enjoy your nothing, idiots. Maybe you should have spent less time in brain class and more time learning how to pick locks. Because it looks like Captain Boomerang... <laughs>
back. Who wins? No one. There are bombs in our heads. We are all losers. The shark's right. She played you all. You played yourselves. Welcome to Task Force X. <laughs> Planning on picking up a bunch of liabilities in Arkham. Ah! Oh, God, there's something in my ear! Did one of you bastards inject something in my ear? In ear CIC comes. Bet we can hear your bullshit wherever we go now. You guys are making a girl miss solitary. Still, sure is nice to be out of Arkham. Thanks, douchebags. Well, we could have started a riot like normal people. But no! Everyone's a backstabber! It was a test. A mind game. I do not know if we passed or failed. Well, four exploding heads are better than one. Where are we going, and who are we killing? They geared us up to take on an army. Wait. Is that big dropkick driving the flame and train? I am not. I have never traveled by train before. Ah, oh, brilliant! <sighs> you jinxed it! This ride's like the Aussie. It's old and it stinks! Joke's on you, love. I'm not that old. Sharkman, pull that brake lever. Big man. What is it? Can you feel that? Feel what? Is is this a trick? <sighs> Old school. Guess Miss Off the Books got something to tell us. Or she made us a mixtape. Australian. Comms don't function that deep underground, so this tape will have to suffice. Here are your objectives. Here we go. Each of you has a C4 charge in your equipment. Use all of them to detonate the old station schedule wall. Go through. Get to the roof of the building you find. Establish comms with me. Way to micromanage, lady. Task Force X. These are your orders. Ignore them, split up, or piss me off in any way, and I pull the trigger on the micro-bombs you so helpfully implanted in one another's skulls. If you survive, we'll speak again. Waller out. I placed my explosive. Yeah, try not to get blown up. Three, two, one! Is this some manner of man bat tunnel? We should keep heading up. 
I say we put many, many bullets in that junction box to make our way out. Now that you're here, I think that makes us pals, too. Wonder Woman thought it would be a good idea to open our doors and introduce ourselves. First off, I'm not from Metropolis. I'm not even from Earth. When I was even younger than you, my world was dying. So my mom and dad sent me to a beautiful blue planet far away. Some really nice people raised me, even though I came from another world. Even though I was different. I love this world. My friends. And yes, even Batman. Let's make a promise. Now I know what you're thinking. That big S on my chest can only stand for one thing, right? Well, not quite. Believe it or not, until I got to Earth, this wasn't an S at all. Remember how I told you I'm from another planet? Well, on my world, this is my family crest. Pretty neat, huh? I have a new family now. And gosh, a new planet too. But I still wear this crest, so I never forget where I came from. Well, hi there, kids. Welcome to the Hall of Justice. We've opened it up just for you today, and there's lots of great things to see and do. Wonder Woman's guarding the inner sanctum, Green Lantern's at the Quartermaster area, or maybe you just want to see Batman's cool Batpod launcher. And in the Heroes and Villains display, the Flash will show off some crime-fighting tools we've used over the years, along with some pretty weird stuff we've nabbed from bad guys. So look around, push all those shiny buttons. At this Justice Day, have a super day. I have read much about the Justice League, and still, they are larger than I expected. Hmm. A prideful display of the Justice League's riches. origin story not the mood of the time shark guy poor harley you think you'd know a guy after you've tried to murder him and his pals for all those years hey man watch the ah shit glass i'm okay what the hell you got there thought this baby was a myth Speed Force Gauntlet. Back when Doc Savannah tried to lift Flash's gimmick. <sighs> Miss Gered. You found 
found the Riddler's hat of invisibility! Where'd the shark go? Children. Ooh, nothing says international assassin like a frickin' jetpack. Shit, I'd break my damn neck. You're probably right. Jetpacks seem more like a death drug thing anyway. Mine. That, uh, hat's not gonna get you vertical, Shark. I can make my own way up. Well, tickle me stupid. Shark can fly! All right. New toys, loaded guns, Let's get up on that roof and get our freedom back. Mm, let's try this stuff out. Never saw myself as a gadget girl, but when in Metropolis, yada yada. No. Quinn, be careful with that thing. I can this door open myself. Yeah, you over but you might it. as well help. I look ployed. Get Waller on the blower. Someone should ask for a company car. You want to expense a deniable up? Well, yeah, mate. Metropolis is pricey as. Yes. Mm, I feel. <laughs> one-way ticket written all over it. Walla! 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 Ah, oh, right. Oi, Walla! What the hell have you sent us into? It's a bloody war zone out here. There's a giant skull in the sky. Congratulations, and... Task Force X. You're the first assets to make it into Metropolis alive. We're sending a signal transponder to your location. Your orders are to activate that transponder. Waller out. Give me one reason why we should go out into that shit show. The bombs, dumbass. Morbid curiosity. Ah. Waller is not offering us a choice. I'm ready to jump off the roof now. Is that a bloody alien? I suppose that counts as activating the transponder. I ain't 
dying next to a steel pimple with legs. Eyes up, people! What does that mean? Shoot the damn things! about security at Arkham. Uh, you know what? I'm in the middle of a recon for Brainiac. Let's walk and talk. <laughs> Look at that. Insurgents can't touch us. Brainiac says hey, it gets... you keep saying Brainiac like it's a thing, but I don't think it's a thing. Brainiac's the one finally bringing order to this world. Make it a home for his people. All this... Soon, it'll be a new planet, Kolu. That's been my mission for, what, three weeks now? Of that and securing loose metahumans. But looking at you, I don't see the potential. Either way, we'll put you to good use. Come on. Uh, uh, Mr. Lantern, sir, uh, <laughs> I'm no meta. Uh, could, could I, uh... I want you to see this. Pay attention, Floyd. Let me go home! Please! Get out! Get out! Looks bad. Feels worse. But once you've been enhanced, there's no going back. Outstanding. You're searching for stragglers. Augmenting Brainiac's army. The shark gets it. We shipped out eight million already. Green Lantern! Help! These resistors just don't respect martial law. Time to rally up with Brainiac. Ready to make the leap? Lantern, I'm putting two rounds in this Brainiac skull. Then I'm coming for you. Yeah? Maybe I'll tell him I only found three metas and one dead body cut to pieces. Flash! Brainiac wondered how you got off the ship. Speedster secret. The League doesn't leave anyone behind. Let's make you right, buddy. You know, that's just what I was gonna say. Waller, send us assistance. Green Lantern... You put a target on our backs, Waller. Green Lantern would have killed our asses if the Flash didn't show up. The Flash is alive and still human. Well, he slammed Lantern off the roof at a million miles an hour. I need you prepared to bring him in. Take the recon path across the city. I'll brief you en route. You're behind enemy lines in occupied Metropolis. Maybe the most dangerous place on Earth. Humanity isn't welcome here. Sounds like Gotham. This Brainiac has deployed a corrupted army to secure the city. Soldiers, tanks, drones, patrols. Ah, uh, there's also a big 
joint spaceship that keeps sapping more of them in. Are you tracking that? I see you've already stolen traversal equipment. You'll need it to stay off the streets.